If you are looking for a piece, just one piece of fitness equipment that you can use at home, it's super affordable, super convenient and portable, and will allow you to do so many things that you might do at the gym where you might not want to go back to the gym right now. If that's where you're at, please, please stay tuned because I am going to do a review of this beautiful new booty kicker. Yep, that's the name of this portable bar. And I'm going to show you some of the great stuff that you can do with the booty kicker. Hi, my name is Renee McLaughlin. I am a master T-Tap trainer. I'm certified in all the different courses in Bar Above, and I'm a somatic movement educator. And I am really excited to bring you Ta -da! the booty kicker. Now, don't you love the name of it, first of all? Yes. This is simply a portable bar. It comes where you have to assemble it, super easy to assemble. They even have videos there that show you step-by-step -step how to do it. You have the stainless steel, great support here, a wooden bar. There are even wheels on one end and gripping feet here. So you just take this out on either side and fold it down. You can slide it right under a bed or up into a closet and then back out really easily when you're ready to use it. So I'm all about that convenience. Past that though, wait till you see all the amazing things you can do with this. Now I've had a regular bar that I have right here. And basically I could put my leg up on it and that's about it because there was no stability. If I tried to pull on it, obviously it was gonna go right back over. And I really didn't wanna put a bar into my wall and mess up the wall. So this is so perfect. Why? Because of the incredible design of it. Now you might notice that in the front here are places where you can put your weights. So you stack the weights there. And I have all different weights in here, but that's also what gives it the great stability. And look how convenient. So I put my weights there and look, you can actually lean all the way back. I'm pulling. You can do your curls and your scoops. You can do an underhand and lift, and it is just so stable. You just want to push against it. Awesome. You want to do some push-ups? You can do push-ups. How perfect is that? Now, you can also add little things to it that will also help you. Basically, it's, it's you're recreating a Pilates and reformer. And so I'll be doing some classes for you that I'll have up on YouTube, showing you how to use this and creating essentially your own Pilates reformer class. Really excited to share some of those things. So if you have some tubing, I just got these tubing. You know, you can put tubing here and use it in whatever way. So you can do a lot of upper body with that. You can even do some side stretches. You might recognize this from your Pilates, if, from the Pilates reformer. How about using a gliding disc? So if you haven't seen these, you can always look, just Google gliding disc. Actually, you can even just use a paper plate. That works just as well. What would you do with that, with this? Well, let me just show you. I'm so glad you asked. You just put your body here right under. You put your foot in the middle of this beautiful little disc and look at what you can do. So you can really get a beautiful stretch. Now I'm gonna go underhanded on this. This is something that you just can't do on a chair and that's why I'm loving this. So you can pull all the way up on the gliding disc. You pull all the way down. You can get yourself some good bicep curls. Look at this, back and forth. There's just so much you can do. You can do a low range of motion here and really stretch out in those hip flexors and pull yourself all the way up. How about going to doing some sides? Beautiful, right? Inner thought. So can you use a chair for this? Well, you kind of can. You gotta get one that's kind of the right height and you have to have one that's really stable. But I like being able to pull on this and not worry about what's happening to do all of this. So. I am loving this booty kicker. Now, it's available to you. I have a link on the bottom here. I was asked to be an affiliate for this, and I was thrilled to try it. And now that I've tried it and I love it, I'm even more excited. So just click that link. When you click that link, you'll actually get $20 off, and you are also going to get this beautiful green bender ball. And you guys, whoever takes classes with me know this is our favorite toy. 
We use the ball all the time to really help us with core strength, inner thigh. So it's so nice that they actually put it all together. So I hope that you found this to be interesting. And if you have any questions about the booty kicker, please just come down here, comment. I'd love to help you. In the meantime, one of the other things that you might want to look at, I have a series that I call my kitchen sink series. It's a series of stretches that I did and I use the kitchen sink. Why? Because most of us don't have any kind of a stable bar in our house. And the kitchen sink series has things like this so that you could have grabbed onto your sink and pressed up and curled over. And we do some beautiful side stretches there. We do some great things where you can push. And look, you can do all of those right here with your booty kicker. So again, have a great day. Any questions or comments, please bring them below. And I'll see you again soon in my next video where we'll actually be doing some classes. Take good care.